your boy Younger B562 coming at you with another review. This is going to get into it. This is the Aqua 8. Let me go ahead and get into it for you guys. So, as we see, we have the new black and gray Jordan box. And there, you know, pretty standard. There's an 8 retro. Let's see the black, bright Concord, and Aqua Tone. Go ahead and get into it. These I wore a lot. I worked that finish line. I wore these a lot there. Had everybody on my head. Where'd you get those at? You know, there's a pain. Story behind these. I actually got these a week early before they came out. What they do, um, if you guys want to get like early releases and pay like maybe ten dollars more, go to your local swap meet. They don't they don't really care about release dates. They'll sell them to you when they get them in. They put them on the shelf as soon as they get them in. That's what I did. They came out. Uh, I don't know the exact release date. I know they're 2007. But they came out, and the week before they came out, I went and bought them at the swap meet. Then went to the mall and talked to some dudes at Foot Locker, and they said, yeah, they come out next week. And I was like, oh, yeah, I already got them. And they showed us these, and they showed us the women's, and my boy was on them. But, like I said, I already got them. So let's go ahead and get into it. Like I said, I wear these a lot. These are, like, one of my all-time favorite shoes. Jordan 8 is, like, my comfortable shoe I ever wore in my life. I don't know. I love the Jordan 8s. I uh, wish I had some more, but I'll give you guys a 360 look at them. Let's see the inside. There is some paint chipping on these. They're like minimal to none of the toe, toe creasing for these to be what, four year, four or five year old shoes? There's toe creasing in that one, but the only thing I have on these that's flawed is you see how it has a little lace, the little like, lock on there? I broke it off on there because I was wearing my work. I'm pissed off about it, but it's not on there. It's on there, not on there. This one has it. But yeah, I broke it off and I was like hot. Anyway, get into the shoe. We have a upper, it is a new buck. Wraps all the way around the mid panel to the toe box. I'm going to put this one down to the side, to the toe box. I like the tongue too, it's like the carpet material in the aqua tone. Purple and black into red jump in, wrapped around a yellow. Yeah. Anyway, the new bug goes all the way around on the straps as well, on the Jordan tabs, and you can see those are roughed up too. On the little pod right there, the black, the back. I'm sorry, the black suede. Little sh short hair on there on the suede. And then we have the uh, pretty hard rubber on the mid panel, but it's painted in the purple right there. Let's see the paint shipping right there on there for you. The aqua tone blue right there, purple on there. Jordan actually wore these in the 93 All-Star game. And so these are only be released, like this is the second time it's been released in 2007 and 93. So this is like a rare pair of shoes. Like I said, I got these early before they even dropped. So, you know. Smooth pickup, I pay like 160 for them. They retail for 150. I pay 160 for them on release a week before I release. So, like I said, go to the local swap meets if they got them. See if they got any Jordans for you. Might be able to catch them like a week early before everybody hyped up about them. So, that's a little tip for you guys. On the strap, we have a 2 3 on there. And the sock liner is black. I do not remember what the Jordan gentleman was when it was there. <laughs> It's not there anymore at all because I say I wear these a lot. They're not there at all. These are authentic. You look at the box and the, the box and everything. Yeah, whatever. The sole is a black rubber. Nice, real, real soft rubber. With the pods going through it, there's a little heel drag on there. I never bought in these, but like I said, these are like really comfortable. Black on the toe part of the, the sole. Have a red jump in there. The aqua tone going all the way down from the tip of the sole all the way down to the middle. Then you have the the you know, psychedelic colors there. You got the red, yellow, black all through the sole. And that's pretty much it. These are like my second favorite pair of shoes that I actually could own because they're like so rare and so comfortable. So like I said, I wear these a lot to work because they're so comfortable to wear. So anyway, rate, comment, subscribe. It's your boy.